course, by this time next year, we will have double our investments in foreign annuities and cut in half our operating costs overseas. Excuse huh? me, sir, you wanted oh. me to tell you what it was for. Ah, yes, thank you very much, Miss Henderson. Okay, everybody, it's nap time. Time to take a nap. Let's go. Come on. What? So, time to take a nap. Ben, you're not suggesting we lay down on the floor, are you? Absolutely, brothers. Come on, it, it's good for you. Come on, you've been working hard all day, and now it's time for our nappy wet. Sir, I don't want to take a nap. All right. Stevens, just put your thumb in your mouth, spread out, and relax, okay? Let's go. He's been under a lot of strain lately. Brothers! Sorry, sir. Don't make me come over there. <clears throat> Steven, stop faking it. What? Oh, oh, I'm sorry, sir. I couldn't hear you. You see, I was sleeping. You're such a faker. Am not. Yes, you are. Am not. Faker. Sir, Leon's calling you a faker. You are a faker. Am not. R2. Not. R2, that's enough. Can't believe how childish you're behaving. Ever since I instituted the policy of nap time at four in the afternoon, all you guys do is bicker, bicker, bicker. That's not true. It is true. No, we fight, too. Your behavior is unacceptable, okay? And now I'm at a loss to understand why. Well, maybe it has something to do with the way you treat us. What do you mean? Well, we act like children because you treat us like children. In order to please you, our superior, we do the things asked of us, which we then interpret as childish. Yeah. That's ridiculous. Okay, everyone, come on to my desk and have some power milk and some power cookies. Then again, maybe I have a point. 